hello, beautiful people of all shapes and sizes. There is now 600,000 of you, which is just absolutely ridiculous. I cannot believe that 600,000 people want to see my face every time I upload. Like, what are you guys thinking? <laughs> anyway, we got the dressing gown on today. And what does that mean, everyone? Who do I think I am? Dora the Explorer. It means we're doing a haul. And today we're doing something a little bit different. A bikini haul. So Cupshe reached out to me and asked if I wanted to try out some of their bikinis. And I actually did a Cupshe haul way back when and I loved their stuff. Basically, if you guys don't know what Cupshe is, it is like an affordable, I think it's Chinese wholesale bikini site. Everyone in America is like, why the heck are you doing a bikini haul? But anyway, I'm very excited to try out these bikinis. I got a size large and everything. I actually ordered these a while ago. So I feel like I could have gone a medium. <gasps> I have the first bikini under here. So let's have a look see. I have actually already worn this. I went fishing down the coast. I know shocking. I actually had to go into the water because we were on a boat and I needed to pee and better out than in. That's what I like to say. This is called the blue ruffled one shoulder high waisted bikini. And it was $27.99 US dollars. And I got everything in a size large on Cupshe or Coopshe. I have never known if it's Cupshe or Coopshe. I'm pretty sure Cupshe would make sense because it's like a cup, like a bra cup. I think I'm making that up. This is actually reversible. So it has the blue color on the bra on the inside of it. Supposed to be like ruffled at the front. Um, it's not really doing the ruffling thing for me because my belly is stretching it out. It was a nice thought, but not quite happening. This is giving me 50s vibes. I feel like bikinis just became legal and I'm on the beach, like living my best life. Okay, even though it's one strapped, I feel like I have quite a bit of security. It's actually quite a nice tight fit. Cupshe has these little pads. And then it has a little hole on the side, on the inside, so you can just pull it straight out. This is the back situation, so a little bit cheeky. Actually, quite full coverage for today's standards. I have a massive haul here, so I better get moving, but really like this one. Super cute. I am not usually a stripes gal, but I really, really like this. I'm just like checking myself out right now. Like, damn, I really like the vibe of this. Like I'm feeling it 70s. I was 50s with the last one. Now I'm 70s. This is one of those swimsuits that you could wear with a pair of jeans. Like, are we seeing this? Or like with a little skirt and then you have a little beach fit. Love it. While we're here, I just want to show my two new children that I got today. Here are my new babies. What's this one called? This is a sedum little master basket. <laughs> and this one is a an epipremnon arian. I think it is super pretty and it's just gonna like hang in the background of my videos. Apparently this is gonna purify the air, so won't need to sage this place anymore after I film. You guys are gonna be looking after these guys with me. If I kill them, it's on all of you. Oh, I didn't even say what this is called. Do I even know how to do YouTube? I don't think so. This is the Chic Stripe Sharing Bikini. $24.99 US dollars. Very, very affordable. You can wear it low-waisted if you want. <laughs> I'm not about that life. I don't think you have the option on cup sheet to get a different size tops to the bottoms. I could see how this top could be a problem for some larger chested ladies out there. So they do have bikini separate. So you can buy the separate bottom and the separate top and it's still about $30 altogether for the bikini separates. So that's pretty awesome. If you are a larger chest or a larger bottom, then you're not left out. You can still get a cute ass bikini. I love the support of this one. I feel like I could jump, do it like a cannonball, dive into the water and I would not be, you know, naked when I come back up. That is literally the worst. That has happened to me one too many times, especially when you're with like your close family, you see your top floating away as you run after it, completely naked up top. 
it's one of those ones that's supposed to be shearing again. There ain't any extra room for it to hang loose, so. <laughs> Is this not really flattering? I feel like a hottie. Oh my god. Okay, what is this called? This is the blue and white stripe halter one piece swimsuit and it was $26.99. One thing I will say about Cupshe, they have heaps of photo reviews. So if you're ever unsure about a swimsuit, you can literally just look at the photo reviews and almost always they're going to have some people showing you what it looks like in person. So absolutely love that. I think this is amazing. I love the quality of it. It's actually kind of tripping me out. Like it's, the stripes are so close together. It kind of looks like it's glowing in the mirror. It is of course a tie up at the back. So you can tighten it to your liking. It does have the little pads in. The pads usually annoy me, but in these cupshe ones, they seem to be kind of staying in place. Ugh. I mean like, <laughs> why did I just sound like Morty from Rick and Morty? I mean like, I think it literally just looks a little bit bigger on this side. So if you want that extra oomph, then you can keep these pads in. Ugh. Really just hugs the waist like nothing else. I think it's super flattering. I love everything about this, but like looking at it is making my eyes go cross-eyed. I think this is the first one piece that I actually am not getting a camel toe with, which is amazing now this is one of those lacy like crocheted beach cover-ups which i have seen a million times okay don't tell me that's not actually really cute i feel like that's so cute i love this i'm actually kind of hot though like it's getting kind of hot now the weather's just up and down or is it my hormones i have no idea this is the white crochet cover-up with fringe trim and it was 27.99 it comes in one size only. Wow, that was bold of me getting a one size only thing. For reference, I am an Australian size 14, which is a US size 10. And this is fitting me like almost perfect. It still has some stretch. So I think you could go possibly up to a 16 in this. I love that it says one size fits all and it's actually fitting me because girls my size will know that one size fits all usually does not apply to us, but this has so much stretch in it that it really can go far. For the price, this is so pretty. I feel like this can really help your confidence of being in a bikini because if you don't feel quite comfortable enough to go full bikini, then you can wear this. And you're kind of in between and it looks really, really beautiful and flattering. I remember when I used to go to like pool parties, I would literally be walking around with my towel like this because I didn't want anybody to see my body. Look how far we freaking come. <laughs> this is such a good dancing dress as well. Look at that. Ooh, ooh. You can hear the plastic ruffling from inside. You know how it has that little plastic slip so your hoo-hoo doesn't touch the fabric? At the Copa, Copa Cabana. Wow, Cup she just did that. Am I crazy or has everything looked really, really cute? I love this. Although the top is very small, I feel like I'm wearing the bottoms backwards because this is a lot of butt cover up. Okay, I think I'm gonna try twist it around and see if it looks better. I like that better at the back now, but now the front seems a bit too scrunched up. Let's have a look at the model. Okay, I'm wearing it backwards now. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> I like it better with a bit of butt peakage. This is the Celadon Green and Floral Bikini. It was $29.99, like a Hulk green, not a Kermit green. I love this little scrunch detail here. It just kind of like makes the boobies look a little bit bigger. Not the most supportive of all the bikinis just because it's quite small up top. I love the detail on the back of the neck. I mean, I don't know what else to say. I really like it. This is called the yellow ruffled back crisscross one piece swimsuit. It was $22.99. That's cheaper than everything else. Um, am I crazy or is this not yellow? That's like a tangerine. And I would not consider tangerine yellow. I would consider tangerine orange. But sometimes I have a really bad judgment of colors, so now I'm worried. Is this yellow or is this orange? For this one, I'ma say, I think I'ma give it a pass. I love the confidence I had going into this one. I was like, give me ruffles, 
give me color, give me bright orange, give me a plunge. Now I'm seeing it and I'm like, it's really cute, but compared to the other ones, I don't like it as much. I mean, the quality is just as good as the other ones. I feel like I don't think it's sucking in my waist as much as that last one piece was. And I don't know, I think it's a lot to take in. <laughs> if you're not a very strong swimmer and you want the lifeguards to be able to spot you from a mile away, then this is the suit for you. Maybe it is yellow. I'm so confused. Anyway, it has quite a full coverage bum and then it has like this tie yuppie at the back. But yeah, not my favorite. Okay, this is 100% orange. I say that and it's like red. <laughs> I like this one so much better. This is called the Bright Day Sharing One Piece Swimsuit, $29.99 US dollars. Love this. I think the color is even nicer in person than it was in the photos, which does not often happen. It has adjustable straps, which is super duper amazing if you need, if you wanna tighten it up for a bit more support. It actually came in like the perfect tightness. I feel like they always come with the straps completely undone. And I'm like, my boobs ain't that low. I'm actually seeing the shirring on this one. Can we see that? It's shirring, so. <laughs> And can we see what I was talking about with the last one not really accentuating the hourglass? Look at this. Look at that. That is accentuated to a T. The back is quite covered up. It is definitely a family friendly one piece. She pulled through. I was rooting for her and she pulled through. I feel very, very supportive. Would be even more supportive if I did up the straps a little bit more. I love it. I'm in Baywatch, Zac Efron's on the monkey bars, and I'm going to go underneath him in case he falls. Oh my god, I forgot that I had this dress that I got. Sometimes I like to get Murray's opinion on what I'm choosing for these hauls. And Murray hated this, so of course I still got it. Am I crazy? Do I not know my color palette? Or is that looking really, really cute together? I love it. A pumpkin! I'm a pumpkin! Oh my god. Fun fact, I used to do tap dancing and I got casted as a pumpkin for our end of year show. I was the chubbiest kid out of everyone. I did not end up going to the tap dancing show. I went to a birthday party instead. Past the parcel was way better than being objectified as a pumpkin for that evening, so I, I like the color. I'm not sure if it's Shrek green. <laughs> Onions have layers. <laughs> I was talking about when like I did pea soup. I was talking about when I did tap dancing and I got cast as a pumpkin. You got cast as an elephant. I got cast as an elephant for jazz. <laughs> I got cast as a pumpkin for tap dancing. Oh, I didn't realize that school was horrible. Okay, mum isn't loving the dress. I really, really like it. It just needs a little bit of an iron, but it's like this wrap around. I think it's super pretty. It's giving me Dakota Johnson vibes and I love Dakota Johnson. This is called the Green Wrap Maxi Dress and it was $29.99. By the way, this was not a one size fits all. This was a large and I'm wearing it wrong. Apparently it's supposed to tie around the front. That's cute as well. I like it both ways. I mean, this would be a very nice church dress. I don't know what you're allowed to wear to church. I've never been personally, but very pretty. This was the one that I was thinking would be good for tanning and boy was I right because it is a itsy bitsy teeny weeny yellow polka dot bikini. This is freaking tiny. <laughs> is this a bikini top for ants? For ants? Look at the spillage right now. I feel like I shouldn't even be showing this. This is R rated. Look at the amount of string that I had left. She's holding on for dear life. Which is such a shame because the print of it is so cute. This is the Blue Crush tie-dye bikini and it was $31.99. Well, now that I'm looking at the reviews, they do say it runs a little small, so. But you know, it's gonna be great for tanning, so I'll use it for that. Yeah, everyone's saying it's a little bit small. Anyway, that's what I get for not looking at the reviews. Size up, I think it's a really nice bikini, but it's just tinsy. Okay, let's move on to the next one before I get demonetized. <laughs> this was another one of my outgoing picks. This is called the Floral and Striped Scalloped One Piece Swimsuit and it was $27.99 US dollars. 
I think it's very flattering on the boobs. Like, look at the amount of support this is giving me. This is giving me cleavage. I love this little lace detail though. Like, they really put their all into this bikini. It's scalloped all around here. The straps are not adjustable, so you're kind of just gonna have to stick with what you got. Something's sticking into me. These like scalloped things are a little bit sharp if they stick into you, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, that's a bit of an overstatement. They're not sharp, they're just swimsuit material, but it feels a bit uncomfortable if one's like tucked in. I really like the low back as well. Look, the scallop detailing goes all along here. That is really cute actually. It's giving me the best of both worlds. I think it's really flattering and I love what it's doing for my boobs right now, so. Okay, and now we only have one more. Guys, I was so excited for this one, but she's kind of letting me down, I'm not gonna lie. The arms are so tight. Let's get a close-up on... <laughs> Can we see that sucking in my arms right now? Like, it's not comfortable. I could feel that chafing for the rest of the day if I was to actually wear this out. Other than that, it is so cute. So why could they just not have made the arms a little bit bigger? The look of this is so adorable. But those arms, they ain't gonna work, sweetie. Uh-uh. I feel like I could still make it work, though, if I just kind of, like breathe through the pain. Anyway, this is the Sweet Floral Bonot Tank Bikini and it was $27.99. I am obsessed with the style of this. Forgetting the fact that the arms are too small for a second, here's what the back looks like. It is completely covered up the top. If you got skinny arms and you're prone to getting a sunburnt back, then this bikini is for you. You actually can undo the bow so you can tighten it to your liking. I'm still wearing it. I don't care. Beauty is pain. And with that, that is the final swimsuit. My final thoughts. I love Cup She, and I am not just saying that because this video is sponsored, but this is all my own honest opinions. I have bought from Cup She before myself, and I freaking love their bikinis. They are just as good quality as the ones you would get in store. Just make sure that you're looking at the reviews. The only thing you need to be careful about is sizing. Usually the reviews will say if they fit a bit smaller or a bit larger. I love that Cup She has plus sizes. I love that they have diversity in the models. I have found some absolute favorites out of this haul. I think I like these bikinis even more than the ones I chose in last year's Cup She haul. I have washed them in the washing machine before and you're not even supposed to do that with swimmers. And they have never leaked, they have never faded on me. So as always, I put all of the links down in the description box for you guys in order. Let me know down in the comments below which was your favorite bikini out of all of them. I think I'm gonna be posting some bikini pictures. I don't know about you guys, but Follow me on Instagram at SusieJTodd if you want to see them, or even if you don't want to see them. I post a lot of other pictures as well. Also, make sure to like this video if you enjoyed it, and subscribe and join our family of all shapes and sizes if you haven't already. You are welcome here. Okay, thank you so much for watching, guys, and I will see you in the next one. Oh, was that an ab I saw? Bye, guys.